Hello and welcome to this Concord Help Center video. This video covers Concord's latest release, version 5.51. In this release, we've added additional font sizes, a high contrast mode, and fixed bugs. Let's start with the new font sizes. We've added an extra large and an extra small font. To change your font size, go to Settings towards the top right hand side of your screen. Next, click the drop down menu under Font Size. You can see we've added an extra small and an extra large font size. I'll click on Extra Large first. You'll notice that the text in the Read panel is now in the Extra Large font size, and the citations in your Lists and Study Tools panel are also a little bit bigger. Next, I'll show you the extra small font size. I'll go back to my Settings menu, click the Font Size drop-down, and then choose Extra Small. Now the font size is much smaller. You can also use these new font sizes in Print Preview. To go to Print Preview, open up a list and go to the three horizontal line List Options menu. Next, click Print Preview. Then go to your Print Settings. And then underneath Font Size, you'll see both the Extra Small and the Extra Large font size. I'll click on Extra Large. The next new feature I'll show you is called High Contrast Mode. To turn on High Contrast Mode, you'll want to go to your Settings, and then under Themes, you can find High Contrast Mode. High Contrast Mode uses a limited color palette with contrasting colors to make Concord easier to see for people who prefer screens in black and white. So I'll click High Contrast Mode. And you can see Concord is mostly blacks, grays, and whites. To turn off High Contrast Mode, simply go to your Settings, click on Themes, and then choose your desired theme. We also wanted to let you know that we fixed a bug that we heard about from customers. So let's say we highlight a citation and then want to share it with someone using Concord links. Now when sharing a Concord link, the recipient, when they click on the link that you provide, will be loaded into Concord and the citation that you've selected will now appear regardless of your attribution style. For more information about this release, check out our change log. It'll be in the description of this video. We've also included it in the release email we sent this afternoon. If you have any additional questions, please feel free to email us at concord at csps.com and we'd be happy to get back to you. We hope you enjoy using these new features and happy studying!